Did you know that we have homes in Las Vegas that were built in the 40s? Well, we do, and McNeil Estates is one of those subdivisions. It was founded by Larry McNeil, and a lot of the streets that are in this area were named by famous people during the time. So you will find Cashman is a street here. So he was a civic leader here in Las Vegas in that time frame. And Campbell, one of my favorite streets in all of Las Vegas, was actually named for a developer who was also a realtor. And then Mason was also one of the developers of McNeil. So most of the homes in this area were built in the 1960s, but some of them started in the 40s and 50s. And they were dubbed ranch homes, which you really don't hear that term a lot anymore in Las Vegas, but it just means that they were single story homes. And yes, there are some two story homes in the McNeil area, but for the most part, they are single story ranch homes. And the draw to this area is that a lot of these properties are on bigger lots. So you can have anything from a third of an acre all the way up to a three acre parcel in some of these communities. So when I go to some of these homes, the homes are gorgeous. You can see that they have been remodeled and reimagined, but when you go into these backyards, the pools are giant, which now you can only have a 600 square foot pool in Las Vegas built, but these pools were for parties. These yards were for parties. They had a lot of room, so some of them even have tennis courts, which who knows, may be turned into pickleball courts today. But the appeal of people who want to move to this area is that I don't believe that there is one home in McNeil that looks like another. They are all custom built. They are stunning designs. You have some mid-century modern. You have some that have a little bit more character than others because there is no HOA. But the people who live in this community really take pride in the homes that they have. So it is highly unlikely that you're gonna see just something that's been sitting. Because if it has, you are going to see people buy it, fix it up, and resell it or move into it. So if you're not sure where McNeil is, you are in between Charleston and Oakey and between Cashman and Rancho. So that area is all encompassing of McNeil. And one of my first memories of houses over here was that some of them have basements. I didn't know you could build a basement in Las Vegas, but you can and they did. And so you are going to find unique styles of homes that you may not find in any other area of town. And so what you have here is a community focused area where when you're driving down the street, you may end up running into a book exchange where you can put in a book, you can take out a book and they share in this community. You may think without having an HOA that things could get a little hairy, but with no HOA, this community actually still finds the time and the participation to have an annual block party. And every single person in this community really cares about not only their property values, but what these homes mean to them. So it's allowing them to have a lifestyle 
that is not only a little bit further spread away from their neighbors, but they are so close to downtown and they get to actually enjoy that downtown lifestyle. And believe it or not, now this is a very central area. So it's pretty quick to get anywhere else in the valley. And yet it's a little hidden away. If you didn't know that it was here and didn't know what this community meant to people in it, you may just drive by. But when you drive through, you are going to see tree-lined streets, mature landscaping, and just a community that cares about what their properties look like. And you are not going to see another area that has such beautiful homes because they're all unique. And they have really taken the care and the time to make this community thrive. So this is one of my favorite areas of town. Not only because I have really great friends who live here, but I really enjoy this area. And if you want to know, I used to get in a little bit of trouble when I was in high school over at Bob Baskin Park, which is right across the street. So this area really is tied to my childhood. So if you are looking for a historic home in a great area where the community actually comes together to celebrate one another, McNeil Estates is where you want to be.